I have the nerve to start up my YouTube channel now. This is gonna be the first intentional YouTube channel. Actually, what I'm doing now is I'm making breakfast. A vegan, pescatarian breakfast. My daughter's a pescatarian. I cheated, but I'm trying to do right, you know. So I'm making everybody, whoever wants to eat it, a pescatarian or vegetarian breakfast. You will see in a minute what I'm gonna make. Uh, you gonna come and join me? I'm about to make some breakfast for pres pescatarian, pescatarian, pescatarian or vegetarian. So come and join me to see what I do. Right now I'm going through allergies. So my eyes are always watering and itchy and they look all wrinkly and inflamed and all this crap. So there's nothing I can do about it. So this is the best I can look. Anyway, let's get started. Gotta wash your hands first. Real good, suds it up. Real good, even the rinse. Rinse it off with nice hot water. Boop. Rinse it off real good. I don't wanna get diarrhea from soap. What? Because that's what you can do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, don't you know that you can get diarrhea from soap? Cut it off. Where's my clean towel? You know what, I like using dish towels, but I hate when people use dish towels to have food on. I feel like when you use a dish towel, your hands should be clean and you're only wiping your wet hands, you know? So when I see food on it, that's somebody else in this house doing that. I can't use it, I have to get my own, take it and hide it somewhere so it'll be my own personal dish towel. Anyway, we're gonna start with the Chipotle, what's the Chipotle flavor of Chipotle? Yes, it's Chipotle. 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 <laughs> what was it called? Chipotle flavor? We usually use Italian, but this is, uh, it's grain. It's not real meat. This is a sausage for vegetarians. And so, Daddy, you want some sausage? <laughs> There's actually a YouTube video where this guy, what does he do? He's hanging it. He makes some kind of contraption where he hangs it up and what does he do? It's hung up all over the ceiling and his fingers. A whole bunch of sausages. And he's playing a piano like. Sausages. And they're <laughs> hanging like this. So anyway, I'm gonna cut these apart and then I'm gonna slice each one. You don't have to cook it that long. And I'm also gonna add green peppers, onions. I really don't need any seasoning with it because this is already seasoned. So that's all I need for that. Then after that, I'm gonna make, um, I bought these cage-free eggs. They're so expensive. Put a little garlic in it, fresh garlic, and I'll either use the Kerrygold on the wood. I'll leave it out just in case I wanna use it. What? What? <laughs> I kind of know. I don't know. <laughs> so anyway, here we're gonna start with this. Daddy, would you like some sausages? And I kind of cut it like this, so it's open. It always drips. And then it's real easy to take the casing, the plastic casing off. I just stick a little hole in there, and then I just look at all that juice coming on there, all that flavor. And then you actually just peel it off like this. Just comes right off. Ta da! And then I'm gonna put it right there. Well, I have to rinse my hands. I hate to have messy hands. I can't stand it. I have a messy hand. You're gonna be washing your hands. And <laughs> all the juice is coming out. It's splattering everywhere. So I need to make, yep, I need to make all of it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you need to make all of it. So, <laughs> why should I make all of it, Asia? Tell me. Because of this. Delicious. It's the best thing. You never had this uh, flavor. Yeah, but I've had field roast, and field roast is amazing. Field roast is amazing. Amazing. So amazing. So amazing. Mm -hmm. Sweet. I like now, how we just singing. sing it two different. Mm -hmm. I shouldn't even sing that one. When I read about it. 
Anyway, here we go. Okay. Smells good. Casing off of all of them. Gonna be cooked together anyway. I'll make no difference. I usually don't do it like this though. I usually don't have the meat and the vegetables sitting on the same cutting board. And you can cut it how you want to small pieces, big pieces, however you want. I'm gonna saute the green peppers and onions real quick before I put the filled roast in. <laughs> Ow! Did I cut myself? It ran across the top of my hand. Let me rinse it off because I got any dead skin on here. <laughs> A layer of dead cells, skin cells. <laughs> so that's that. My onions are not cut up. Move over, move over. Look at it. My onions, get my onions. The red, they call these red onions. I don't know, I'm just gonna pull out a plate and do it on here. So anyway, I'm gonna cut these up. I love onions. These are gonna make me cry, watch. Just watch. These are some strong onions. I'll be getting stitches if I cut myself. <laughs> cut, 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 cut. cut Look at my eyes now. I'm crying. <laughs> okay. I have to run my eyes on the water. Oh. <laughs> now my eyes have to clear up again. Now I'm cutting up the field roast like this. I got the idea of field roast from another YouTuber. Anybody know Tabitha? She cooks a lot of um, vegan meals. And what? What is that? Turn your nose this way. You got water. So what? I'm trying to, cause it's like bothering me. <laughs> like it's just. I thought it was a booger or something. And you it on my shirt. Anyway, Tabitha does. She has a YouTube video. She cooks a lot of vegan meals and stuff. She made a hot dog from a carrot and put it in a bun and had coleslaw on top of it or something. I'm going to have to try that because she invited her kids into her kitchen and they ate it and they turned back around and they came back. They wanted another bite of it. I'm going to have to try that because it looked good. It looked real good. But anyway, this is the finished. This is finished right here, the cutting. And like I said, I don't usually don't mix my meat with um you know anything else but i'm just doing that now for some crazy reason but now i'm about to saute the green peppers and the onions in this pan should i put it in the big pan a little pan no i'm gonna put it in the little pan because i want to put some no i'm gonna put it in the big pan and put little potatoes in there so i'm gonna put about let me see about that much because it's all it's gonna soak all up then I'm gonna put some more in here because I'm making ooh, some potatoes. I'm gonna season my potatoes. They used to have um, a seasoning at Sam's Club and I bought it. It was, I used to use it. It was mixed with Himalayan salt and seasoning mixed all together. I can't find it in Sam's Club anymore. It was really delicious. So we did that. So now I'm gonna turn on the heat. Turn off a hot, hot skin and red. And I have to cut my potatoes. I'm having a chip in between. I love, look at that little black thing on the chip. Guess what, I'm gonna eat it too. <laughs> These are so good. You know, not too many ingredients in this when you eat this. The ingredients say potatoes, vegetable oil, sunflower, corn, and canola and salt. Sometimes you get chips and it's a, I had to wipe my nose. You get a list of ingredients. I'm gonna wipe this finger, clean it. <laughs> watch me, watch me now. Okay. <laughs> Stop. I'm 
Yeah. So now, oh, I'm supposed to be coming over here to get my potatoes. I got these big jumbo potatoes. How many should I make? Two, just two. One. Look, look at these jumbo potatoes. Look at this potato over here in the size of my head. I mean, it's big. I'm just gonna make two of them, okay? I'm gonna rent, I'm cleaning this off first though. I know some people say you should clean your stuff with vinegar. I mean, I usually clean my stuff with um, soap. <laughs> oh, you said sugar. Dawn. I usually clean my stuff with Dawn. Let's say, let's say you can clean it with vinegar and I'll rub it real good and get all the black dirt and stuff. Ooh, my stuff is popping over there. Let me go back over there. And I think it's hot enough. I got, woo! I, woo! It's talking to me over there. Now I'm gonna scrape this. I'll turn this water off. I think I'm at, look how I got the, look how I got the um, knife pointed to you. <laughs> You're trying to kill me. So now watch this. You ready to run? And now the onion. I love garlic. Garlic is a good natural antibiotic. <laughs> we eat a lot of a lot of garlic in this house. Fresh garlic, garlic capsules. When you get sick, feel like you're coming down with a cold or the flu or something. Don't go to the doctor. All they're gonna do is give you those pharmaceuticals, those antibiotics that do harm, that have toxins in it. It's gonna do more harm to your body. All you do is grab, believe me, grab you some garlic. It's 100 milligrams. And you can take this every hour. Wait, you You can take you some garlic. And every hour, and alternate between garlic and echinacea and golden seal. This is a natural antibiotic too, so if I take this at eight o'clock in the morning, I take this at nine o'clock. I take this at 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock, 12 o'clock. And you do that for like, do it for eight hours, for two days. See if you feel better, okay? Or you can use another type of antibody. This is a antibody too, you can use that. Vitamin C. Vitamin C, but you gotta take, this is only 500 milligrams, so you have to take more milligrams than that. You really have to fill your body up with it, you know? Just think how strong antibiotics are, you know? You gotta put enough of the, the garlic and the golden seal and echinacea in your body, you know? So I'm gonna, this is kinda late, putting uh, the fresh garlic in here. So I turned it down so I can add this. Now I'm gonna turn it back up. Turn it back up. Turn it back up. Oh, you know what I like to put on here that I didn't put in here? So, 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 and pepper here. No. <laughs> what? I know they said that. Salt and pepper. Don't you know who salt and pepper is? I anyway. Know that song. Put a little pepper in here. Okay, my eyes are watering, so now I'm gonna start sneezing. So if you hear a sneeze, this is the reason why. Choo, 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 choo. <laughs> Get all in the crevices real good. Sometimes I rub so hard, I rub the skin off. Cause I like to eat my skin. I mean, not my skin, but the skin of the face. <laughs> Oh my God. Got my spatula and take my field roast. Put it in here. With my sauteed onion, and green pepper, and garlic. Yeah. Hey, Jaden, you smell it? Mm. 
Now, take these thick potatoes over here. Jumbo potato. Ouch. Now for the potatoes. And this is what I do too though. Sometimes before I even put anything in it, I sprinkle salt in the oil. I sprinkle salt in the oil. I sprinkle salt in the oil. This is a Himalayan pink salt. Sprinkle a little pepper in there at the bottom so it'll already be in there. Sprinkle garlic in here. Mm. Much as you want. I like to put a little cilantro in it too. I'll put a little cilantro in it. I think I'm gonna cut up a little, a little bit of the carry gold and put it in. About this much of the carry gold. Because look how many potatoes I have right here. I got all these potatoes right here and just this little carry gold. Mm -hmm. Mix it all up. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Now I'm putting the potatoes in here. Okay. I know y'all probably saying I'm putting a whole bunch in there, but this is the good salt. Put a little more garlic in here. Ginger. I'm gonna cut some more of this Kerrygold. Put it in my pan. Oh, my pan is still on. Dang, it's gonna be brown. <laughs> now I'm gonna have brown eggs. It won't be green eggs, gonna have brown eggs. <laughs> no, nah, that's too brown. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> wait, what? <laughs> oh no, wait. Who, how you do that? Who, what's the dance y'all do? Is it shoe? Who, shoe? Oh, shoe. Shut up. Yeah, you. Okay. These are my eggs. Everything else is done. And we're gonna put it on the plates. I like to eat my eggs just like this, but Asia likes hers all done. Yeah. Fully done. I like a little slime left. But this is it now. We're done. I'm gonna fix the plate. YouTube. <laughs> this is my first YouTube channel. Actually, it's not. I put stuff on YouTube before, but this is intentional now. So I'm going to start up my YouTube channel now. My daughter wants me to do it. Her name is Aja Janae. A J A J A N A I. So you can look at her YouTube video and you can comment, like, subscribe, turn on those post notifications. Said, do it all, baby. Yeah. <laughs> That's what she says at the end of her videos. I'm gonna do a lot of things. Maybe interview people, uh, do some cooking, talk about herbs, vitamins, uh, do pranks, uh, do vlogs, whatever I could think of because I'm bored. 
I'm bored. I have to do something. Okay, so anyway, I hope you'll join me in watching my videos. And if you're looking at my video now, you come and pass my video, Jamie. So if you're looking at this video now, just watch it a little bit, you know. And if you like it, then like it. Put a thumbs up. You can subscribe. Give me a comment. <laughs> and you can share it. What else do you have to do? Post. Turn on those post notifications. I said, do it all, baby, yeah. I said, do it all, baby, yeah. Don't steal my Peace. <laughs> <laughs> so, stay tuned. And you'll see what's in store. What am I? <laughs> I say already before this. I said, uh, I already told him what I was gonna make, gonna right? Be doing interviews, pranks. No, but I said uh, I was gonna start out. You got all that, right? Got the pescetarian stuff, yeah, making a pescetarian. Oh, Anybody so I said, so it. stay tuned. Oh, do it over. So, stop. <laughs> no. What is your So, so. Stay tuned. You might like what you see. Say it one more time. So stay tuned. What? I'm sorry. It's not... Okay. So stay tuned. So you can watch what I'm cooking.